Hello there, everybody. I'm Mr. Dimpie. And I met Otis from the series. No, not really. Oh. No, not really. <laughs> or GW. Always oh, white. It's white. Oh, yeah. That's the bluish white ink. Nice. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, last time we finished up the, uh, the second level, the second world of the game. And uh, today we're going into the third world now. And uh, we're starting with a level where mostly everything is invisible. Yeah, this is one of my favorite levels in the game. Really? And this is why I, I think I remember this in control. <laughs> Very good. I'd imagine that with everything being hidden and stuff, the sunken scroll might be kind of difficult to find. Yeah, it's pretty much you climb a thing, and you have to fall from the side of it. And oh, actually, I think, I think I might know that one. Yeah, and, and don't, don't be afraid because there's like a platform there. Like, oh, okay, you safe. Yeah. Gotcha. But uh, yeah, if there was ever a time that you would fall down and die, it might be this level. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure that this level, or at least a level like it, appears in one of those limited ammo levels. So oh, yeah. you pretty much have to memorize where all the invisible platforms yeah. are to be able to get through everything. Oh yeah, oh, and I think this and is this the part. Is it. This yeah. is it. Yeah. Yeah, there you, need to, you need to go from, from the top? fall down? Yeah, yeah, I think I do. Yeah. Yeah. Well, at least now I can see where I'm falling. Yeah. Uh. There we go! <laughs> Got it! Now I can just uh, climb back up this way. Yeah. Excellent. There you go. Also, uh, I now have over 813 crystals. It's so over I'll be 800. Able to get... Yeah, it's over 800! So I'll be able to get that last ammo upgrade. Yay. Finally, will Thomas get the other upgrades? Eventually! <laughs> Alright, let's go. So, 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 Thomas, what do you think of... of we're close to the, to the last Splatfest? Oh man, I'm, I'm kind of sad because I never really got to do that many Splatfests. Yeah, I mean, and also, I have always forgotten to collect the Crystal Snails afterwards. Oh. Every single time, I forget. Also, they cancel if you don't collect them? Yeah, yeah, they do. Oh, wow, I didn't know that. Yep. If you forget to collect them within a certain amount of time, you don't get them ever. Oh, poor snail. <laughs> yep. So, I've gotten the, the king rank or whatever twice now, and I haven't gotten a single crystal snail out of it. I, I think that gives, if your team wins, it gives you 30. For sure. Well, I never won, so... Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, uh, can you imagine doing this with limited ink? Like, no, I need to see where I'm going on these platforms. Yeah, unless you really know the level, you're like, okay, no, there's a platform here. So. <laughs> MLG. <laughs> oh man, MLG. Thomas is M M L T L T L G. <laughs> yep, that's me. All right, here we go. Okay. So I'm guessing we're nearing the end of the level at this point. Yep, there is. There's the zapfish right up there. I can see it's glow. Kaboom. Spark. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh okay. You, you have the, the equipment, though. Yep. That helps. More like that kill. That. <laughs> you know, speaking of octopi, uh, I actually went to see uh, Finding Dory recently. Oh my gosh, I'm so jealous. It was really good. Oh! Fortunately, you have three lives. Yeah. Well, I think I will see the movie Um, uh, by the time I go to the US. I hope it's still in theaters. Is it still in theaters in the US? Yeah, it is. Okay. Yeah, yes. it was really good. It was a lot of fun. Yeah. Because it hasn't premiered here yet, which is weird. Usually with Pixar really? films, usually with Pixar films, they'll, they premiere at the same time as the US. Or not this one. That's odd. Yeah, but oh well. I will see it this weekend, so it's not bad. Excellent. The best part is I will see it in, in English, and I usually prefer seeing like American movies in English. Makes sense. Yeah. I can't shoot the through here. Yo, you need. Oh wow. You need the. Uh... Oh my god, they're in jerks. They are brutal. Yeah, try to throw a grenade and they will get scared. Yeah, I guess they could. Yeah. 
it's not dying. Oh, there we go. I hope. Just, they have the high ground. If you have the slosher. Yeah, if I had the slosher, <laughs> that'd be great. But Thanks. I don't. Thanks, Miyamoto. <laughs> there we go. Finally got past that level. <laughs> Find a path. Yeah. All right. So yeah, in Ink Visible Avenues. Twice a year, the Inkopolis Collection Fashion Show captures the hearts, minds, and wallets of the city's youth. There is no room in these creatures' minds for anything but battle and fashion. And uh, yeah, there we have jellyfish. But I guess the jellyfish. I guess they're considered attractive. I don't know. That's also another thing people want. They want uh, more creatures like jellyfish, um, like the, the creature that is Sheldon and the shrimp. Oh yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah, a different race. That's not where I expected it to connect, but okay. <laughs> yeah, uh, I know that there's a thing over there. I don't want to get to it, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. Let me just uh, <laughs> be able to build up momentum here. Literally build. Oh, that's oh! Not what I meant to do. <laughs> oh. but I guess this works too. Yeah. Literally building momentum. Yep. And there we go. Getting, in, getting into the hole. Mm -hmm. So, where we end up? It's a level! The Ink Rail Skyscraper. I don't remember this one. <laughs> oh no. Well, I always say that in like, oh, I remember now. <laughs> that was my team boys. Oh, I remember now, guys. <laughs> <laughs> But but you're 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 the you're the group's proton John. Yeah. Oh yeah, because I'm from another nation. Yeah. The opposite. And also you're blue. Oh yeah, and blue. <laughs> yes, and blue. Can't forget about being blue. And I was about to take the Kermin. Oh. <laughs> but can you do a Waluigi voice? Wah! Like... <laughs> oh, uh, Daniel does a good Waluigi impression. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, in fact, he has a Waluigi hat. Oh, nice. Yeah. Unfortunately, Whenever the Waluigi amiibo comes out, I am so getting that. Yeah, also, uh, of course, my friend Daniel also. And I was in this video because I mentioned him. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Now, this is fun. I wish this... Uh, I don't know how they were able to put them uh, on the game, on the maps. Uh, mm -hmm. To put them on the, uh, the levels where you find on online. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, it would be pretty cool to... Okay! Oh! <laughs> It would be pretty cool to have this in one of the levels. Oh. I'm being a ninja. Yeah, you mean Middle Gear Snake? Solid Snake? No, Solid Squid. Yes, <laughs> Solid Squid. We prayed, literally. <laughs> oh, with boxes. Actually, no, no, it would be. It would probably be like Solid Eel. Yeah, Solid because, Eel. Yeah. Because it's like a snake. Snake, snake, snake. Also, Thomas. Yeah? I, I'm getting three new cats. Oh, really? Yeah, by tomorrow. Nice. So there's going to be a little bit invasion in my house. Oh, it's right here. I remember oh, now. Oh, where? Uh, you need to... I think it's the middle you go around. Like the middle oh, one. Oh, I see it. I see it. Hey, once nice. again, I, I went like, oh, I remember now. <laughs> there we go. We got it. Well, I got it. Yeah. You helped me get it. So yeah, we got it. This is with teamwork. The power of teamwork. What's going to work? Teamwork. What's gonna work? Teamwork. More like meme work. Oh. <laughs> but Thomas, can you, can you can you meme? Oh, I can totally meme. I mean, look look at just look at SpongeBob. He is meme. It's true. Totally a meme. I mean, look at WWE lately. They're been memeing so much. Oh man! <laughs> are you? Are we gonna beat up John Cena? <laughs> oh my god! I can't believe you did that. Yeah, <laughs> we're gonna beat up John Cena after this recording. Yep. We're going to uh, we're going to beat up John Cena with ink. Yeah. We're going to ink up John Cena. I actually, I oh mean, I forgot you didn't take the picture in time. There's one time in the lobby where John Cena, well, a guy with John Cena name tag appear. Oh but, really? But unfortunately, I forgot to take out the picture, and I was planning, oh, I'll take a picture and. Tweet, oh, who beat up John Cena with me? <laughs> but no, nice. it didn't happen. I remember the the one time, I have like two Team Fortress 2 videos. Yeah. And uh, 
in one of them, there was somebody with the name John Cena, and he was playing as a pyro the whole time. Oh, I think I saw that video. And he let me down whenever I was playing as medic. Ah. Uh. So yes, I, in that scenario, I would beat up John Cena. Yeah. <laughs> oh wait, I cannot do that. That's copyright. Oh no. And also, I, I just realized that I had uh, I forgot to increase my uh, maximum. Ink. Oh, do it now. Yep. Also, uh, with the creatures on of the surface driven to extinction by rising sea levels, the ancestors of the Inklings were free to haul their tin-legged bodies up onto the abandoned land. This is how the Mollusk Era began. And uh, yeah, we can we can see squids. Nice way Come to kids. Nice way to cover for the key rated or M rated. <laughs> yeah. All right. So real quick. Let's get this last upgrade. Yeah! Maximum ink! You can get one more upgrade if you want. Oh, yeah, I could, but not, not to the thing that I want. Okay, oh, you I want... Don't, I don't want it. You want to upgrade your hero shot? Yep. Next, I'm going to be upgrading the power of my weapon. I think there's a thing down there. Uh, oh. No, nope. there wasn't. There wasn't a thing. Oh, but wait. there was a thing! Do -do -do -do. <laughs> totally our bone. Yep. Oh, oh okay. Uh, it's this level. Explore. Oh, Remember to explore. boy! So yeah, once again, this is based on one of the multiplayer levels. Yeah. I remember and, I uh, I actually like this level quite a bit. Yeah, I remember hating it at first because I always swim in the middle rail. Like, yeah. I was like, oh, you didn't know. Now that I know how to go around. Yeah. Uh, I like this. Plus, also, this is one of the best maps I can play with the Octo Brush. Oh yeah, it is an Octobrush map for sure. Yeah, and also Slasher because it has, uh, level. Mm -hmm. Yep, it definitely is good for the Slasher as well. I'm just moving around here casually, you know, wandering around. Oh, I, I think I know where's the, where's the, uh, the Sunken Scroll. Oh really? Yeah, it's kind of like in this section, but uh, in reverse, so it's in the other side. Gotcha. Oh my gosh, there's just so many things right now. Yeah. Oh. If it was online, we'll probably lag. Nah. <laughs> yeah, probably. Actually, the the lag isn't bad in this game, yeah, ever. It's only, really. it's only bad if your internet is bad. Okay, it's probably... And my internet is not bad enough for the lag to be bad. Yeah, so far... Uh, earlier it was because the, apparently the mods I have was all already. Oh, really? Yeah, so once they replace it, it actually got it on the thing that's... Yeah, there. there it is! Alright, we got it. Don't swim here, Thomas. Yep, that would be bad. I swim a lot there when I tried... When I carried the, the Rainmaker, I'm like, Oh, no, they're coming! Oh, bye. Sh yeah. Oh, the bubbler. That's not a good thing to do. Yeah. Oh, I love the bubbler so much, but sadly, a lot of, a lot of people don't like it. Yeah, I love the bubbler. It's beautiful. Yeah. All right. So yeah, basically, now that I have maximum ink capacity, I'm never going to run out of ink, pretty much. Yeah. I mean, look at that. He's not running out of ink. <laughs> nope. And he can recharge with the bubbler if he wants. Yeah, that's true. I could. Bubbler makes me invincible, by the way. Yeah. So it's good. Oh, you're dead. Sorry, Tones. I died by ink. All right. It's Let's go get our thing. Oh, actually, you get bonus if you, if you don't use your power up, the, the bubble. Oh yeah, that's true, but only like ten. Oh, okay. It's not, it's not really that worth it. But I guess every point counts. Yeah. All Good. right, let's see here. Oh, I love this oh man, this was level fifteen. Yeah. Oh wow. This. It's too much. This is the only existing photograph of the legendary Squid Beak Splatoon. The young man folding his arms appears to be the leader. When this picture was taken, the Great Turf War had been raging on for over a year. I love this photo. Oh yeah, it's great. Alright! Uh, let's try to get one more level done. Yay! Somewhere around here. I mean, look at how much I'm shooting and look at how much ink I have. Let's just see how long I can keep shooting without having to reload. Oh, if only we was like this in, in, in multiplayer. Yeah. 
uh, especially the the Octobrite. The Octobrite is you should like uh, you slash like ten times and that's it. Ink is over. Yep. Oh, there we go. Finally ran out. Yeah, that was a really long time without having to yeah. reload at all. Do you have Do you have problems with the ink uh, the sloshers? Not well. Uh, yeah, I, I actually do. Sloshers use a lot of ink. Okay. So I have to go into the ground quite a bit. But due to my typical play style, that's not too much of an issue for me. Okay. All right, here's a level. Oh, level this 13, one. Level 13, shifting platforms. Uh, I think this one has a pretty. Oh no, it's not this one. Okay. Oh, oh right. this one. Hmm. No, can I remember I... for now? I don't remember much of this level at all. Oh, well, maybe I remember this level a little bit, actually. Because, okay. yeah, you have to go into the ink to be able to get <coughs> past those gates. Ooh. Oh. There we go, got him. So, so, so tell us how, how is Game Watch still now? Oh, man, uh, I haven't done anything with him <laughs> in a long time. He's copyrighted? Uh, yeah, totes. <laughs> totes, dude. <laughs> Yeah, same with Mr. B. He was totally copyrighted. Oh yeah, totes, man. That's that's what he is. Nobody's gonna get these references to yeah. all the characters. Uh, oh, remember, remember Connect Genexus? He was totally copyrighted. <laughs> I mean, hey, at least uh, Genexus has enough of an original idea. Yeah, right to, now. Uh, all right. A new yeah. How was it? A new monster was born. I forgot. I'll write it. Yeah, something like that. I think the video is still up there. <laughs> Probably. I know that a lot of my old videos are still around. But uh, on the channel that they were actually uploaded on, which is not this one. Yeah. I remember there was a time you were using more another account and not this one. Yeah, because I was doing roleplay stuff on YouTube back then. Not anymore because streams are dead. Yep. Not, not, this, but... not the new streams, like there was other kind of streams on YouTube. Yeah. Now I do all my roleplaying on Tumblr. Ah. And uh, it's been a pretty good time overall. Ah. Yeah, doing a, a, a Skype and sometimes Facebook. Gotcha. Okay, well, the one quarter that I didn't ink was the one quarter that I needed. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's do this. Oh! Let's oh. do this. There we go. Oh, Yay, I did it! I think it's down here. Not sure. Oh, really? Yeah, down there. Alright, one second. I think... Yeah! Whoa! There it is! Yeah! Got it! Now oh. I just have to go all the way up again. Yeah. Yay! You almost missed that. <laughs> yeah. Alright, here we go. So, whenever I was at SGC, uh, there was a big panel about, well maybe not a big panel, but there was a panel about uh, the making of Ruby Grim Eclipse, huh. which is the video game based on the uh, animated series Ruby, made by Rooster Teeth. And uh, originally I was thinking, hey, whenever I get home from SGC, I'm going to download this game on my computer and I'm going to let's play it. It's going to be really great. And then I looked at the reviews for the game. Oh. And it seems like it is not very good. Oh. I heard it's mostly so, for... It's mostly by fan service. Like, it's good for the fans. Yeah, pretty much. And I mean, I am a fan, but at the same time, I just did a Let's Play of a game that wasn't all that great. It was mostly disappointing. So. What, what was it? Uh, my number nine. Oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, my but... number nine is so forgettable, you've already forgotten. Yeah, I already forgot about my, my number nine. I even did the thumbnails. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, you did. You did do the thumbnails. They were great. You know what? I, why I did it? I thought, oh, I, can, I guess I can find PNG pictures of this very easy. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Only, only um, my uh, only back and what was the name of the girl? Uh, call. Call was were the only ones I found easily, like PNG pictures. Yeah. Oh, the other. Thing. <sighs> All right. Well, with that said, that's gonna be the end of this episode. As soon as we look at the uh, the new secret scroll. Ah. So let's see what we got. Is 
heralded by loud explosions, the great Octo weapons quickly stormed the Inkling's central stronghold. Victory for the Octarians seemed all but certain, but due to a plug being carelessly pulled from its socket, their hopes were dashed. Oh, it was this one. Oh yeah. <laughs> so uh, yeah, we've been fighting the great Octo weapons, and uh, yeah, they were fairly dangerous, but then again, one Inkling could be oh, the thing. So, maybe they weren't really that dangerous. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> so, with that said, I've been Mr. Game Pie. I've been George UW. And we'll see you next time. Bye! Goodbye.